What's a nine letter word for a significant event? Try milestone. Longtime crossword constructor Bernie Scordon recently marked two big ones. Happy birthday to you. She turned 100 this past Saturday. And on Wednesday, Gordon became the first centenarian to have a puzzle published in the New York Times. For years, every crossword I've published of Bernice's uh, has set a new record for age. You know, when she was 95, she was the first 95-year-old puzzle maker, then 96, 97, 98, 99. And, uh, you know, I hope to keep doing this when she's 101 and beyond. So I can't use it yet. Gordon has been creating puzzles for decades, her grids appearing in many newspapers and puzzle books. Although her early efforts were rejected, she kept at it much to the dismay of her mother. And she said, my child, if you would spend as much money and time with cookbooks instead of crossword puzzles, your family would be happier and better off. The Times printed Gordon's first puzzle in the early 1950s. She liked the challenge and the extra pocket money. And she'll spend hours and hours looking for the right word or the right phrase. So she really keeps her mind active. Gordon still builds one every morning in the pre-dawn hours, surrounded by dozens of reference books. I just don't sleep. I love working in the middle of the night when it's dark and quiet. And if I get an idea, I fly to the computer and I start working. Using a century of knowledge to challenge her crossword fans. Okay, that's how you do it. Matthew Burgoyne, Associated Press.